Welcome to the company update. TerraX Minerals is now called Terra Resource Corporation. TerraX Minerals did a name change last week into GoTerra Resource Corporation. The new symbol for the TSX Venture is now YGT and in Frankfurt it is TX0. The company has 160.5 million shares outstanding and fully diluted 178.4 million shares. Cash on hand is around 5 million Canadian dollars. 37% of the shares are in retail hands, 31% are held by institutions and 21% from close associates as well as 11% from management and employees. Goldterra explores the 790 square kilometer large Yellowknife gold project nearby the city Yellowknife and in the neighborhood of the old con and giant mines which produced over 14 million ounces gold in the past. To date, they did over 60,000 meters of exploration drilling from 2004 to 2019 with a district-wide prospectivity analysis in 2018, including lithology, geophysics, geochemistry and lake sediment samples. In November 2019, they presented their first resource estimate with 735,000 ounces gold. In 2020, they have an ongoing 10,000 meter long drill program at Sam Otto. This first resource comprises all in a three kilometer radius with Sam Otto being the largest deposit with bulk tonnage potential, Castorum showing as an underground deposit with high grade gold in quartz veins, and Miss Pickle and Barney are smaller deposits for open pit and underground north south to the shear zone east of Sam Otto with high grade gold potential. Semoto is a pit constrained inferred resource of 426,000 ounces with 10.8 million tons at 1.23 grams gold per ton to a maximum depth of only 200 meters. It is open in all directions, untested to the north, south and at depths. Of high priority is Christaurum with a strike length of 3.5 kilometers, 10 to 25 meters wide and approximately 3 kilometers from Sim Otto away. It is modeled for a shallow starter pit with high-grade gold mineralization before moving into an underground operation via a ramp and shaft. The underground section is defined along the strike lengths of 1.2 kilometers over widths of 2 to 15 meters and to depths of approximately 200 meters and is interpreted to be the extension or a duplicate of the con mine Wien system, which might be over 1 million ounce of total production in the future. The Christorum Wien's area, comparable with the ones of the Con mine. It also looks like the main structural break of the Con and Giant mines extend on the Yellowknife Gold project with 65 kilometers of strike lengths, mostly untested, already four gold deposits today defined and all open and many gold targets identified and untested. Main goal is to present in Q4 2020 an updated NI4301 mineral resource for both deposits. The Northwest Territories are on the path of becoming a new mining hub and they granted Gold Terra the NWT Max Award for Environmental and Social Responsibility. The drill permits were issued in record time and three mines were permitted in the last five years. The company has strong community support for mining. With their excellent team around David Suda and Jared Pendleton, the founder of Detour Lake Gold, this exploration company is an interesting quality play for a future gold production. We keep you posted. I'm your host, Jochen Steiger, Swiss Resource Capital, in partnership with Dukas Kompi TV. Thanks for watching us and bye-bye from Geneva.